There was a time when the idea of a flying car captured the imagination of people around the world. It was a bold, almost sci-fi vision of the future, one where vehicles seamlessly transitioned from roads to skies. Out of all the flying car concepts that have surfaced over the years, few have come as close to turning heads and pushing boundaries as the Klein Vision Air Car. And honestly, it may just be the sexiest flying car that could have been. The Air Car is the brainchild of Slovak designer Stefan Klein, whose resume includes work with major automotive brands like Audi, Volkswagen, and BMW. His vision began as far back as the late 1980s with a rudimentary prototype called the Aeromobile One, which didn't quite take off, literally or figuratively. But Klein's passion didn't waver. That early concept paved the way for a refined version known as Aeromobile Two, which introduced a transforming body design that allowed it to switch between car and aircraft modes. Sadly, it too was shelved and is now displayed in a museum in Kosice, Slovakia. But then came the air car, and the dream was alive again. First introduced in 2016, the air car made headlines in 2019 after its maiden flight at Nitra Airport in Slovakia. Then in 2024, it returned to the spotlight when music legend Jean-Michel Jarre took flight in it, a moment that added star power to this futuristic machine. What sets the air car apart from other flying car concepts is its stunning design. It looks like a sleek sports coupe crafted from carbon fiber with a semi-monocoque construction and a steel frame. The transformation into flight mode is powered by 20 programmable servo motors that control the extension of wings and tail booms. It's an engineering marvel. Under the hood, or should we say behind the propeller, is a 1.6-liter BMW engine running on gasoline, generating 139 horsepower. Although a more powerful 300-horsepower version was in development, it never reached completion. The air car weighs around 2,400 pounds and is over 17 feet long. It drives like a regular car on roads, but when needed, it takes off after reaching 75 miles per hour over a 980-foot stretch. Once airborne, the air car cruises at speeds of 105 miles per hour and offers a range of up to 620 miles, reaching altitudes as high as 15,000 feet. The design cleverly integrates aerodynamics, using its spoiler and pitch elements to generate lift in the air and downforce on the road. Under the process, which may include help from overseas companies and legal assistance, public interest in rotable aircraft is fading. VTOs, while not drivable, are more practical. They eliminate the need for runways and pilot licenses, and people seem more willing to drive to a VTO hub than learn to fly a car. Still, the air car remains an icon of ambition. It represents a time when the dream of flying cars felt within reach, a beautiful fusion of automotive design and aeronautical engineering. Even if it never reaches full production, the Klein Vision Air Car will be remembered as the closest thing we had to a true flying car, and perhaps the sexiest one ever imagined.